it's not every day that a lucky man like myself can sit next to a Bond girl. And let me tell you something. And I'm telling you something. This is this is a day that I will remember for a long time. <laughs> let me tell you something. Because I'm I'm sitting next to the lovely, the lovely Miss Lana Woods. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Thank yes. you. So you don't want to tell people about all the other days that you come and sit. It's uh, just today that you were like, okay, I can keep my mouth shut. Well, no, because it. because now I have you know I have I have a great story to tell. I, I'm sitting next to a Bond girl. What can I say? <laughs> it's not every day that I that I can do that. Now, of course, Lana Wood. You may remember her from a lot of movies, but of course, you know, I, I have to mention, of course, the James Bond movie, yeah. Diamonds Are Forever. Yeah. I mean, now, first of all. Have you done a lot of these conventions and, and, and... I have. I don't usually come to a lot of comic cons, but a lot of shows that are specifically James Bond, um, different things like that. So, yeah, I do. I love them. I go to a lot of Western-themed shows as well because I've been in a lot of Westerns. Talk about some of the, your other work that, that people may or may... Uh... Remember you from. Oh my goodness! Wild Wild West, mm -hmm. uh, Bonanza, um, yeah, um, Police Story, mm -hmm. Peyton Place. I was a regular. Uh, the Long Hot Summer, Capital, another TV series, um, Felony Squad. Um, I don't know. Oh, Not, The Searchers, The, the Searchers, Searchers with John Wayne. But that he, was the first. That was my very first job too. Oh, I, was, I was eight. What, what a great way to be introduced into the movies. I the know. Movie I know. Very good. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I but was for, lucky. But for anybody out there who still doesn't remember any of those movies, how about you being the sister of what the lovely, oh, lovely, lovely Natalie you. Wood? Yes. I mean, yes, my dear sister. Yes. Now, uh, uh, oh, he brought me my dog. There you go. Oh, oh we got. Oh, we got here a dog. he's gonna be on reality TV. Yeah. Oh, Joe Bridget. Oh. What's his name? He's a little scaredy cat. Her name is oh. Willow. Willow. Oh, I love you, Willow. Is oh, it's a girl. She doesn't like the uh, the microphone. She doesn't no. like it's she's okay, sweetheart. Oh, I love you. Oh, that she's face. I would, if I could, I, Willow, I would kiss you right there. <laughs> I would. Look at, she's looking at Dad. She's like, it's, it's, it's like, save me. Here. I'm an Ewok. Save yeah, me. She... One particular scene, if if my memory serves me correctly, where. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Where You're wrong. You were oh, yeah. thrown. You, you were wait. thrown into a swimming pool. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I'm assuming. Yes. I'm assuming, if we can talk about that scene. I'm assuming it must have been your stunt double. Yeah, you're assuming wrong. Oh. <laughs> Tell us about that. That was me. That was me. Oh my God. Yeah. Like I, they threw me the first. The first shot was they threw me out of a window, first story window, just onto a mattress. Okay. So that was the first shot. Then we moved to another hotel. And they set up they set up a 10-foot platform with a nice big sturdy six-foot something stunt man, and I stood on his shoulders, and he pushed me upward so that the angle of the fall was correct. Mm -hmm. So the last 16 some odd feet were also me. 16 feet. 16 feet, and it was a long way to fall. It doesn't sound like it. It is because when I came up sputtering and hit my mark and they said oh we're gonna have to do it again there was i was like ah uh, we mentioned earlier that your sister of course is the, the lovely uh, natalie wood yes. what, what what can you tell us about her that m that many people out there may not know about her that they may not know yeah because you know she, she was well she was funny she was um she she loved it when we were together going out away from everybody else because then we could be mischievous and silly and and she liked that. She didn't get much of a chance to do that. Mm -hmm. And um, she was a very, very loving, dedicated mother. Mm -hmm. Meant the world to her. Mm -hmm. And um, what else? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I could dispel a lot of myths. You know, she was not a drunk. Mm -hmm. She did not take drugs. Mm -hmm. um, just a lot of that nonsense that is purely that. It's just yeah. nonsense. Last year, I believe it was, they decided to reopen the case in the death of Natalie Wood. I want to get your reaction on that, and, and if, is that something that you're on board with? Or, or they... um, yeah, I have to be. I, I want the truth mm -hmm. to come out about Natalie. It's just very, it's very important. Mm -hmm. um, she doesn't deserve what has mm -hmm. gone on, and she doesn't deserve 
yeah. to not be remembered properly in the proper fashion. Um, it was actually only reopened once and has been an ongoing since then. Uh, new coroner has gone over all the information and pointed out that all of the bruises, the bruises on her neck, the bruises all over her arms, legs, back, were, are not consistent with bumping into a rubber dinghy, mm -hmm. uh, nor bumping into anything else. It's just abuse, bruises. And um, she only had uh, sea foam in her lungs. She did not drown. She may have been unconscious when she hit the water. So those are all the new findings. And it's very upsetting to me, mm -hmm. you know, it really is. Yeah, and as a matter of fact, if, if, if memory serves me right, they've decided to uh, uh, talk to Mr. Robert Wagner as a witness, I believe, or, or something to that effect. Person of, of interest. Person, yes, person, person of, of interest. interest, yes. You know, which, you know, um, it, yeah. it, it should be interesting to say the least, uh, you yes. know. But, um, you know, we, we hope in there... We hope there's closure in, in, as far as that goes. But I am starting a new film called Bill Tillman and the Cowboys, mm. and it's a period western that's going to be shot in West Virginia, and I'm really anxious to start that because it's a great role, and it's good, serious filmmakers, and it's very exciting for me. So you're starting in a western. You're going to have to do uh, maybe ride, ride a lot of horses? Is, I you know? hope so. I hope so. I haven't kissed a horse nose in a long time. I need to blow in their nostrils and rub oh, the nose, boy. kiss that horse, you know. Well, stay tuned for that. And in, 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 the, in the meantime, you know, if you're lucky enough to come to one of these conventions, you know, you might be lucky enough to run into a Bond girl, you know. Just you know, don't hurt her. Run, no. in, run into her softly. Yeah. Because she's plenty. I, she's plenty she was, too. I was plenty, and now I'm more than enough. <laughs> Thank you very much for being on reality. You're welcome. Mm -hmm.